Good day, sports fans. My name is Jerry Worley, and let's take a trip back in time to 1967-68 when we had the Big 32 in Montana. It lasted from 1963 to 1969. Here we have the final 1968 standings. The media grouped all 32 teams into one big conference. Here we can see that Kalispell won it that year at 17-1, and the conference uh, standings, regular season. We see Wolf Point at about fifth, 15 and four. Yeah, 67, 68, remember the graduate? That was what was going on at the time. But even bigger in Montana is when the Wolf Point Wolves won the 68 title at the tournament in Bozeman. This is March, 1968. And that's the MVP of the tournament, 6'3", Steve Def Deathman. And there's the great six foot four Willie Weeks. The Wolves traveled 450 miles back home to Wolf Point on Sunday. A thousand people met them at the Elks. Caravan of uh, 12 miles long stretched all the way back to Oswego, Montana. Let's meet the Wolves and the Elks Sunday evening. This is 6'3", Greg Redekop. 6'3", senior Steve Deathman. 6'9", junior Big John Weeks. 6'3", guard Jim Rodenberg. 6'0", guard Harvey Longlogger. Uh, and one note about Harvey, he was an All-American quarterback that year, Sunkissed All-American. Speaking of football, the great Lynn Ahrens, he was 6'4", 6'5". Uh, one of the key leaders of the team, all Big 32 Guard Bruce Erickson, he was a senior, 6'4", Willie Weeks, junior. Uh, Dennis Dillon ended up state boxing champion, AAU boxing champion in 1977. And 6'4", Larry Smith, Scott Eldridge, the manager. Coach of the year, Ron Harshark. Here we have Ron Harshark being carried off by the Weeks brothers. So we have two stories for you, one on the Big 32, and one on the legendary Weeks Brothers. Can't have the Big 32 without the Weeks Brothers. Let's take a trip to 1969. Now we have Midnight Cowboy was the number one movie, also starring Dustin Hoffman. 1969 tournament, who's gonna win it? This was the last Big 32 tournament. The mighty Laurel locomotives were number one. Would Wolf Point repeat? Well, they thought that Laurel and Wolf Point would meet in the semis, but they didn't. Butte Central knocked them off in the afternoon. The great Butte Central Maroons, led by Joe Antonetti, Jim George, Dan Mahoney, shut down Willie uh, by denying him the ball and denying him his favorite place to shoot from. And they were coached by Otto Simon. So Laurel won it this last year. So there you go, sports fans. Let's bring that big 32 back, and I hope you enjoy the two articles. Thank you.